Oh, well, we're back on, it looks like. Is this just gonna be one of those days? Well, I'm changing the music. Changing the music, I don't care. We crashed again. We crashed. Oh, come on. Like, is it just gonna be one of those days? Is it just gonna be one of those days? Hmm. We seem fine for now. I do want to buy an unlocker. I can't buy another one. However, there's something else I want to buy. And I could probably buy, like, a full set, even though I probably won't need it. I'm pretty sur sure uh, subchips transfer between playthroughs. I want to head this way anyway. Subchip sub dealer. Untraps. There we go. It doesn't cost much. Is it a single mystery data? Or is it like Battle Network 2 and 3 where it lasts the entire time you're on the net? Anyway. We'll test it out. But if we're going to be ex expecting green mystery data, we might as well try out Untrap and see what we can find. Actually, you know what? You know what I might do? Since we did crash at a very... Hold on. Let me, uh... Yeah, our crash happened very soon. Like, after I started. How about this? Wait. Oh, okay. How about this? I might delete that VOD? Assuming we don't get another crash, like, very quickly. This will be stupid. But let's just say everything's fine for the rest of the, rest of the stream. Uh... I'm going to delete that other VOD, that, the one that lasted like 13 minutes, and we're going to treat this as basically just like the beginning of the stream. So I'll just reiterate basically uh, what I just went through. So again, didn't miss much. I took, I have a list pulled up of blue and purple mystery data. The purple mystery data... I didn't need to actually go back and check. What I needed to do is just look at what we unlocked, and with after a couple double checks, I do have it all. But just to mention, there's like 11 purple mystery data. And you could check stuff like your folder, whether you have most of this. And that's what I did. So, uh, I'm just gonna mention here for, for, the, uh, for this run, ACDC 2, you get Geyser L. Town area one, you get that HP memory. That one, you basically need to double check. Uh, town area two, you get Blinder Star. I had two of them. I double checked. I didn't see a purple mystery data there. Town area three, you get Cuss Sword B. I have that. Town area four, you get Wind Rack A. I have that. Park area two, you get Var Sword V. Park area three, you get Color Point Star. Yum Land area, you get Lance G. Charo area, you get Black Bomb Z. Undernet area 1, Snake M. Undernet area 4, Guardian O. Those are all the purple mystery datas. So, if, so then you could double check. We are going through and looking for blue mystery data. I will be double checking the normal net, but we're going to check everywhere else first okay town uh, elect tower comp one and if we crash too soon i might just 
I haven't saved yet, so that's a good thing. You know, might just, you know, anyway. Elect Tower Comp 1, there are three blue mystery data here. Spreader M, Reg Up 2, and some Zenny. We're just gonna do a quick run through and see if I find any blue mystery data. I'm pretty sure I was thorough the first time, but you never know. That's the thing, you really want to be thorough. I'm not seeing anything. And luckily I have a high enough level for me to just run away. Okay, I, I did not see anything, so we got all three. There are three mystery data's in uh, uh, Comp 4. A Longsword S, an HP Memory, and one Bug Fragment. However, again, I'm pretty sure I was thorough. But it's all, it's just a good idea to double check. I saw a Guardian, I could have used it, but I just kind of want to speed this up. Just get the blue mystery data stuff done. Eh, fine. I could use the extra Zenny. That's just the sonar. I'm not seeing anything. I think we're good. I guess I'll just continue to double check. Can I go down here? Yeah, okay. Look around here. Now, this is where I wish I had Sneak Run as the Navi Customizer program, but I don't. I need to save my buck frags. Okay, I'm not seeing anything. I think we're thorough here. Okay. Now I'm going to check the Toy Robos. All four of them. Sneak Run was a Bug Frag Trader one, right? Or is that one I could buy in Castello? You know what? I'll double check that. Again, I have not saved. So, if something happens to the stream, I can always back out. We get one crash and now I'm worried, you know? Honestly, that's not a bad one. I don't have the money for it, but that's not a bad one. Shield, fast barrier, custom one, which I already have one. Okay, no. I think Sneak Run was a bug frag trader one. Alright. So I'm basically going to have to just run away from every enemy. Bug frags are better to get later on. Just get what you can. Alright. There are three blue mystery datas in Toy Robo 1. I'm pretty sure I was thorough the first time. But it's always a good idea to just double check. Nothing there. Nothing on that dead end. Nothing there. Okay. There's still more places to check, but, you know. Oh, I should have tried Guardian on these things. Oh, well. It's also not a bad idea to get whatever chips we need from viruses. However, uh, we're not locked out. 
so it's not a big deal. We might be locked out of certain codes, though. If I don't give them now. Or infinite amount. Okay. Well, let's try it. Okay. It... The sheep don't uh, deal damage into it. Okay, I do have a way of hitting him. I have two ways of hitting him. There we go. That is one way of dealing with the sheep. Get a, get a rock in the way. Okay. I don't see any blue mystery data. Yeah. Wait, did, did I put Gun Soul 3 in here? No, I didn't. I have three. Also, that is definitely a program advance. Probably should mess with that. But, for now, let's just get the blue mystery data. This would actually be a not bad of an idea to create some sort of uh, check like, markable checklist, like, on a website. That just kind of saves, like, your information. Right, Molly? I know. What? You need to go outside? Are you kidding? Come on. Okay, nothing here. Nothing on that dead end. Wait, did we crap? Okay, hold on. Molly, I see you. Okay, nothing. Yes, Molly, hold on. We're gonna enter in the second toy comp. Just in case I didn't say it, three mystery data in Toy Robo 1, Reg Up 1, HP plus 50, Navi Customizer, and some Zenny. There's three more in Toy Robo 2. I'm pretty sure I was thorough. My dog, I guess, needs to go outside, even though it wasn't that long ago when she was. Okay. I'm gonna take a second to take care of that. We'll see how the stream is by the time I get back. We'll see.
Okay. Uh, we're back. Sorry about that. How's the stream? Looks like we're still on. We have not crashed. We'll take it. Let me swap it back over. Okay. So right now we're going to double check Toy Robo 2. There are three blue mystery data. I probably have them, but we are double checking. be thorough okay nothing at that dead end nothing there okay yeah this game could really use some sort of checklist that you can like just go on a website it kind of saves like some of your information and like you're playing through you're playing through this game, it, it, like there's a list of all blue mystery data on like the first playthrough, and you as you pick as you grab them, you mark them off. So that way, you know you don't have to double check everything. That'd be nice. All right. Uh, nothing. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing here. Okay. I think that was the last section of Wiz Dog, but we'll keep going. Nope, there's another section. Might as well double check. Okay, got one there. Got one, uh, nothing there. And nothing here. That should be the last of it. Like yeah, that's the last of it. Nothing. All right. The three mystery data that were in there were Rock Cube Star, Vulcan 2B, and an HP memory. Toy Robo 3, there are two. So we're going to double check. There are two blue mystery datas that were, that are or slash were here. You know, I was thorough the first time just so I wouldn't have to double check everything, but it's just a good idea to just double, double check everything anyway. Ugh. Um, sure. We'll do this fight. I had a feeling this guy would dodge it. That's kind of why I was hesitant. It's fine, whatever. Dead end, okay. This area is good. Nothing here. Yeah, 
I'm not gonna waste my time with Guardian. I already know the one guy is gonna dodge. Dead end? Dead end. Okay, we're good. We got this section cleared out. Next part. Oh wait, no, I can I can get these guys. Extra chips or Zenny is always a good idea. Especially when it's a quick win right like that. Here, nothing at that dead end. Guardians, no. And I know that panel in the middle is gonna break. Nothing over there, nothing there, and nothing there. Okay. And that should be the end. Okay. So, there was a charge plus one and a reg up two for that one. And then last toy, Robo. There are two in here. Someone was imposter, uh, an imposter for him. <laughs> okay, so there are two here. Do a double check. Get off the raft, yep. Okay, nothing up there in that dead end. Nothing here, okay. Yeah. Luckily, these are the same one, so... That's nice. Dead end, nothing. Dead end. Dead ends. Okay, all dead end. Nothing there. This is a good thing. It means I was very thorough the first time. Then he, he's gonna stop at right here. No. <laughs> it's pointless. I'm pretty sure it would just go to the, yeah. Wait, Django's here? Django's here. What? I I don't remember this. If this was here ever since the in the original game, I don't remember this being here. Okay, hold on. Nothing there in that dead end. Nothing there. Nothing. Nothing. Okay. I was thorough the first time. Okay, well, why is Django here? I mean, it makes sense like this is where he would be, but I don't I don't remember this. Let's see what's going on. I'll teach you a good luck charm to lift your spirits, follow my lead, and shout, Tayo! 
Well, feel better. Hi, Mega Man. Is that Gunsoul 3 coming in handy? You know, when I was chasing after Shade Man in the Undernet, I felt a tremendous force of evil emanating from Undernet 3. I wonder what that was. Hmm. Okay. I know what that means. Uh, okay, so that was just kind of nothing. Interesting. I didn't know that was there. Okay. It was a recover 80J and HP memory. Uh, the next... There, uh... There's still the blue mystery data that I need to get in the final dungeon. We're not doing that just yet. We'll come back for that. Okay. Now I think we're doing, like, the... Those were basically just the mini dungeons. Other than, you know, the final dungeon that I still haven't done yet. Now we're doing, like, the very small, like, jack-in spots. Microwave. It was fi uh, 500 zenny, which I remember getting right away. It's not a big deal. It's always a good idea to double check. Alright. Here we go. Alright. Doghouse. Doghouse had a barrier A. Nothing. Okay. Game console. That would be in Dex's house. Game comp. I could have used, uh, I could have used, uh, Guardian of Elmo. All right, nothing here. That was Counter 1, Teddy Bear. That is Male's house. Oh, no, that, wait. But it's broken at the moment. Oh, no, it's Yai's house. No? It, it is in Mayo's house. Okay, now I'm confused. But it's broken at the moment, so you can't do it now. Really? Did I miss out on it? How come I can't get in there? Unless it's a different teddy bear. Okay, we're still good. Hmm... Now I want to double check everything. Order supplier, yeah, right. Uh, power return, life sink, get in two. High cannon C. Long blade, super Vulcan. Yeah, need a lot of money. Huh. Let's double check. It's weird that Yai doesn't seem to have any extra jack imports. Just her computer. Yeah, her computer is the only thing that actually has a jack in spot. That's so weird. Normally she normally she has one. That achievement must be for, uh, okay. must be for, like, jacking in, like, a hundred times or something like that. Not in our house. Yeah, it has to be, it has to be here. It's broken at the moment. 
I don't think there's a way to fix it. Or maybe I missed my chance? I really hope that one is uh, not missable. Yeah, I hope that one's not missable. It is a mini bomb star. Now I want to look at the other stuff just in case. Okay, bug frag and what else do we got? Zenny. I'm just double checking. Lock enemy. Okay. Okay. For some reason, we can't go into the teddy bear. I don't know why, but it has nothing important. The mini bomb star. Okay. Uh, where? Where's our mini bombs? Yeah, I don't have it. But let's be honest, I'm not going to use Mini Bomb anyway. So, I am I basically missed out on that. Well, there is a way to get it again, but... Okay, well, unless it's, like, not here. Anyway, Elect Town. Joe Monsterio. Maybe there's like a teddy bear here that I missed or something. Checking the stereo. There are two here. Nothing. That's fine. Sure, this is a quick fight. You know, when's a quick fight like that? Alright. That's the stereo. And then the monitor has one. Oh yeah, the stereo had panel grab star and reg up one. The monitor is not this. CD comp? This must be it. This would have had a reg up too. Okay, nothing here. Now for the hot dog stand in Dendome. Hot dog stand has an HP memory. Okay, nothing here. Drink machine. That would be this. Vending machine, drink machine. Okay. It's a Recover 50S chip. Nothing here. Card reader. Ok, 
Okay, this had an unlocker. I don't... Okay, wait a minute. I don't recognize this one. I think I missed this one. The sink filter. Water comp? Okay, whatever. Oh, here it is. We get the fish program. You know what? That might have not been available until after the tournament because we didn't get the Navi customizer until after. So now we can have a easier time finding aqu aqua vitamin. Uh, finding aqua viruses. What do you say? Drinking water straight from the tap is not good. My job is to clean the water so people can drink safely. I didn't go in here, so. What do we got for viruses? Okay, just larks. Might as well get a double bleat. Okay, it's a good thing I did this. Cyber Top. This one's technically optional. Because, you know, you have to fight Top Man, and you don't always fight Top Man. It would be Zenny. I love to go in circles. Why? Because I'm a top program, silly. I live to spin. Wee hee hee hee. I don't remember talking to you. Okay, well, it was just Zenny. I think this is one of those ones where they're not going to be that, because this one's like really optional. Yeah, this one has more zenny. Um, super. More zenny. And let me guess. Uh, bug frag at the very end. Okay. Yeah, okay. If you don't get Cyber Top, don't worry about it. There's nothing that important. Nothing that important in the Cyber Top. That's a smart one, by the way. That's a smart move. Alright. The Cyber Battle Machine. Or the Den Battle Machine. It's a good thing I'm doubling. You know, I'm checking everything. Okay, but I had a spreader M. Okay, now we're going to Castello. We're done in Den area. So there was one spot that I missed. That's cool. Okay, Castello. Ticket machine. Okay. This has a sub memory, which I have two already, so I probably already. I remember getting it, but just be thorough. Be thorough. Alright, nothing here. Ice cream cart. That would be down here. And again, there's still the blue mystery data in the final dungeon. This has an HP memory. Okay. Okay, now the battle machine for the tournament here. Oh, what do you say? Castle, real castle. Yeah. We did go in here for laser for that dark Mega Man bit. Um, okay, I'm constantly swapping between pages, so I'm confused on whether or not we crashed or not. That battle machine is a battleground for navvies, so we programs need to stay fit. I'm running to get in better shape. Yep. Now oh, that was the same one. Left, right, left, right. Does running even do anything for programs? 
That's a good question. Oh, yep, yeah, yep, okay. HP memory. Yep, there we go. It's a good thing we double-checked. We were in here for the Dark uh, Mega Man part, but... Uh, I don't think it let me explore, or I just didn't check that corner. I don't know. All right, good thing we checked. Now we're going to Netopia. I got a statue. 150Z chip, which I'm pretty sure it's just currently in my folder. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. Hero statue. Okay. I hope you like this music. It never ends. Expand memory. That would be for the Navi customizer, which I'm pretty sure I got it. see anything. Coliseum Battle Machine. We did not get the opportunity to do that. So yeah, I did not check this one. Man, what do you all say? Weakness is not permitted in Electopia's net battle machine. I'm sprinting to increase strength. Run, 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 run. Our hard training should help improve this machine's performance. I gotta check. I gotta talk to the one in the middle. Yeah, I'll let that guy talk. Okay, I kind of separated the two. <sighs> Is this really doing anything for the machine? Yep. You didn't get you didn't get a chance to go through here. Might as well get a triple delete. Zenny, uh, this is where I really want collect. Spin pink. There we go. Statue comp. I think that's Yum Land. So let's check Yum Land. And I believe that's over here. Actually, I know, I think I know I got this one. Actually, hold on. Uh, spin white, yep. Yeah, I have that. Okay, so, statue comp, yeah, I got it, okay. I mean, it's just nice not to hear the danger music, you know? Because this is not, this is not fun to listen to. Buddha statue. Okay. Zenny? Any, it looks like I got it. This one might be one that's locked, depending on what uh, side quest you end up doing, so. I don't know. All right. Uh, Netfrica. 
I guess we're saving Water God for later, which I know I need to go through. New Popo statue. Okay. Sub memory. Which I have two, so I should have this already. I'm just, just double checking. Come, Guardian. That's the mainstay in the folder. Ooh, Guard Star. Don't think I had that. Did I talk to you? Well, if it's born from nature, it returns to... Yep, okay. I talked to you. Alright. We got that. Lion Statue. Nothing here. It was a reg up two. Now I think we're getting to the point. Well, we're saving Water God for a little bit later. I'm just following this list. Actually, no, Water God's at the very end. Okay, you know, let's take care of Water God now. So in Water God statue, there's a couple things here. So there's a lot of blue mystery data. Most of them are. Uh, most of the Water God stuff is, like, just small amounts as any. Like, a hundred. However, in Area 12, there is a full cust. In later playthroughs, it's 10,000 zenny. So, we need to get full cust now. Okay, so... I'm going to follow this little map thing. Also, there is another thing to mention about the water comp. You remember that gold prog that I found? The gold program? Apparently, every time you jack in, uh, there's a 1 in 16 chance that gold Mr. Prog will spawn in area 2, 9, 12, or 14. If you talk to him, you know, you get full HP, but there are a total of 8 rewards you can get from him, and it will pick 5. But you could keep coming in to get those five, and there are no duplicates. And some of these are chips. Like, for example, we could get Wide Blade C, Long Blade S, Lance A, and Recover 120 Star. And if you want a chance to get those chips, you have to do it now. And some of them are Zenny, some of them are Bug Frags. If you really want them, go right ahead. It's up to you. We already encounter him once. Anyway, so blue warp. I'm getting full focus. Blue warp. Green warp. One four. Green warp. Eleven. Blue Warp. It says there's like a full energy here. Oh, okay. This is just to... I see what... I see what's happening. Back. To 11. Yeah, I see 100 zenny. It's nothing. Pink warp? There was a full energy in that uh, area 9. I think that's why we went there. Uh, blue warp to area 13. I think we're just going backwards. Area 13. Pink warp to area 10. Blue warp to area eight. Green warp to twelve. Eh. 
Yeah, a dead end, okay. There's full cast. There we go. Oh, that's a mega chip. That was definitely needed. You won't lose out on it, but now that I have it, every time, I, if I were to come back here, it's 10,000 zenny, so. All right. Good thing I made sure to grab that. Good thing I was told about that in the first place. Anyway. I didn't see Water God. So yeah, if you really want to try to get those chips from the Water God, Gold Prog, be my guest. I'm not trying to get like every chip code or anything. All right. Now that we've got that taken care of, I think we've just, we're missing out on some of this. So the antennas have each jack-in spot. However, I can't reach them because of the snow. By doing cold man scenario, then you'd have access to these. So I think kind of like the kind of like the spinning top. We have to come back for these. Kind of just seeing if someone will give me like a shovel, but no, I think it really is. We need to come back. Okay, hold on. Uh, let's check in here very quick. Space center comp? Computer comp? No, maybe. Okay, so in, in the four antennas, one of them has a reg up one, one of them has a HP memory, one of them has bug bomb G, and one of them has the battery uh, program to attract electric viruses. Let me check the other difficulties and see what we're looking at. Because maybe once you get it once, you're good. Bug frags. Bug frags. And then very low amount of zenny at the very end. Okay. So really, the first time going to the antennas is the only thing that matters. That's the only thing that matters. Okay, speed, uh, there's supposedly a speed plus one in here. I probably had it already. We're just double checking. It says Sharo Space Center Comp. Not sure if that's what this is or or not. Okay, nothing. Could be talking about the Could be talking about this one. Space Center HP. This might be it, actually. I'm pretty sure we went through here anyway. A shortcut. Way to the undernet. Nothing there. Nothing in the middle. Nothing. Okay. So, we've actually... We've checked all of the blue mystery data, except for just the normal internet areas. Let's double check those internet areas. How much money do I have? Okay. I have a bunch of untraps already. So that's good to know good to have, I guess. Apparently there's no jack and ports at Naxa, so other than like the final dungeon. Now, I'm pretty sure we got all the blue mystery data here. We haven't crashed yet, so I think we're still good. And you know what? Because we haven't crashed, 
We'll keep it this. We'll keep this. Okay. Checking the internet areas for blue mystery data. I'm pretty sure I got it all. But gotta be thorough. We are gonna be very thorough. I don't think there's anything in the locked areas because you're not always able supposed to go through here. But hey, if I have access to it, let's just look. Obviously, there's Blue Mystery Day in the final dungeon. I'll look for those when we uh, get there, but that's the last thing to check. Green Mystery Data. Okay. Actually, can I even use Untrap? Okay. It's on. It should work as long as I'm in the internet and don't leave. Kind of like normal. If that's the case. So yeah, there was Bug Stop and a Mini Energy. Bug Stop was behind the door. We got that last time. Oh, we could get this. That could be Bug Frags. Yeah, it is Bug Frags. Nothing there. That was Bug Stop. I don't see any other blue mystery data. I think we're good. Again, we're not going to be taking care of navvies for now. We're going to save that for later. Area 2 has no blue mystery data. So, we're checking area three. Mm, nope. Okay, one of them was behind the skull door, and then that was jealousy, then copy damage star was, I think, over here. Blocked. The ice PC. Can't get in the middle. That was jealousy. I don't see any blue mystery data. Getting very small amounts of Zenny. So we'll check back here just in case. Okay. Okay, nothing. Town area one has sand ring star. Pretty sure I have that. Hi, Molly. What? You want attention? I, I'm checking blue mystery data. Or, yeah. I'm looking for blue mystery data. I'm getting close, though. Where's your bomb? Where's your squirrel? You just want attention. Okay. Hold on. My dog wants attention. Okay. Come here. Come here. Hi. Yes, I know. You want attention. You're so needy. You're a needy dog. Uh-huh. Yeah, I know. Give you some attention. I know. Okay. So yeah, once we finish checking out the internet areas, I think we can safely go to the final dungeon and then move 
and then continue on with this game. Alright, Molly. Again, we're saving navvies for later when we have stronger chips. Right? 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 Yes, 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 yes. Where's your bone? Oh, you found your squirrel. That's good enough, then. Okay. Checking for blues. Checking for blues. Nothing here. Yeah, so far I didn't need to use my untrap, but untraps are very cheap to get, so I don't really care. Untrap is still in effect, right? Yeah. But also, we haven't run into a virus anyway. Okay. We got all the blue mystery data here. We got sand ring. Town area 2 as an invis star which i'm currently have equipped but you never know uh town era 4 does not have any blue mystery data so we're not going to be bothering there nothing down there that was probably the purple Anything over here Zenny. Okay. I'm gonna just quickly take, uh, grab this green mystery data. Bug frag. Okay, need that. Looks like we got it. I didn't see any blues. Town area three has recover 30 R. Pretty sure I have it. Check it down there. I don't see anything. Bubbler. Okay. Uh, I'm not seeing anything up here. Is there anything in the lower section? Hmm. Green mystery data. There is a dead end that I couldn't really see. We'll check there very quick. I did get a, the blue mystery data on the top right. I remember uh, getting that yesterday. Oh, I could really use a uh, guardian for that. Now let's check down here. There was like a section I couldn't really see. Yeah, okay, we're good. We'll grab this green. Copy damage. Alright. I think that was a blue mystery data in an earlier one. Just means you could get one copy of it sooner, I guess. But we need to grab them. So the next uh, thing unlocks. Okay. There are two in park area one. There was one up, uh, up that way, which we did get. Anti sword N and a reg up one. If, if we really want to, we can double back through town area four. But I remember getting it last time. Here. Anti sword N, reg up one.
rack. Alright. Park Area 2 has an HP memory. I think it was from the sea slider. Nothing here. Again, I know I checked through the internet areas yesterday, but I didn't have a guide. Or just a list here, so... any out of that. Can't go that way. So far, my favorite internet music was three. So far, that had the better music. Okay. Check the teleporter. Yeah, I think it was over here, which I got. Over here, I don't see anything. Down here was the unlocker. Here's a green. Ah! You know what? We can hit him. We could get through this. I want to get in the middle. There we go. Double delete. S rank. I got air hockey E. Good. 300 zenny. Perfect. I need a new air hockey. Alright. So yeah, I got the HP memory. Park area 3. I will make the save. Gonna make the save. Uh, park area three. There are two here. Mega folder one and a single bug frag. Okay. Nothing in these two areas right here. That's fine. Here, green mystery data. Wide shot. Okay. Rank ten, another E, and we'll take it. Nothing here. Take the sleeve slider, which that was an unlocker, I believe. Bug Frack Trader. Oh, you're the one with Sneak Run. Anti damage, collect. Oh no, I could get collect right now. Oh. I know we eventually need to buy everything there, but, like, collect is very useful to have. I don't know. Maybe I should have saved it, but... Oh, well. Power and Zenny. If I really need a chip now, I can try to grind for it. That was a dead end.
How's the game going? Uh, we're just doing cleanup. And it looks like we got park area completely done. Um, make a folder book. Okay, so now we gotta check the like the Yum Land and the Natopias. Yeah, right now we're just going through blue mystery data and making sure we get everything, Tyler. And purple mystery data, of course. Um. Okay, if I want to go to Yum Land, we'll start with Yum Land, we'll go to Netopia, Sharo, and then backtrack through Netfrica so we can get to under that. So, we'll start in Area 2. I'll throw in an un untrap, because why not? Yeah, so... I have a list pulled up, Tyler, of blue and purple mystery datas. I have, I already looked at, like, say, my chip folder, because most of them are chips, to see what uh, purple mystery datas I've gotten. We got them all already, so that's not a big deal. Blue mystery datas, we've been going through and just checking everything. And it turns out I missed some, so it was a good thing I've been double checking this. Uh, there are some blue mystery days that I can't get because they are from the Cold Man scenario. Yum Land has a single blue mystery data. A reg up to. I am pretty sure I have it. I really need to make sure, you know. Oh, you know what? Ah, uh, no. He might jump around. Oh, dang it. Can't run away, I guess. Actually, maybe I should get rid of you. Fine, if this is what we're going to be doing. Good, I hit them both. So Yum Land currently has a single blue mystery. Yeah, yeah I, I know. Like, it's definitely really noticeable if you play anything other than Battle Network 4. <laughs> but, like, Battle Network 4, if you really want to try to not have to do more playthroughs than necessary, you really got to look right now before you beat the boss, you know? Just make sure you get everything. I mean, you're not locked out. It just means you'd have to do more playthroughs. And do you really want to do that? I did use my bug frags to get the collect program. So now I can... If I really want a certain chip, I can set that up. Untrap activated, and we got Zenny out of it. That's something. Untrap is still working. Good. It's work how it normally works. Green mystery data. Thunder 1B. I think I have one of those. Collected. I know exactly. I wanted to make sure to grab that now, but that used up all of my bug frags. Like, every single one. So I have zero. So that kind of sucks, but, you know, kind of need it. I could have saved up for the meteor, uh, you know, the meteor, uh, giga chip. No, mega chip. My bad. Okay. Eventually, we're gonna need all the bug frags we can get. Speaking of bug frags. We're gonna grab this. Okay, and we are just gonna make a buster like that. There we go. Yeah, there were a couple places that I missed. 
Uh, there's a water purifier faucet in the den city, uh, the den tournament, uh, like waiting room area, like the sink. I didn't, I didn't go in there. It got me a, uh, the fishy program to let me attract water viruses. Uh, I also didn't get to really explore the two, uh, uh, tournament, pro uh, the, the, like the Hawk tournament stadium, uh, like display or the battle program, whatever you want to call it. And there's also the blue moon tournament one that I didn't get to explore. And they both had stuff. And then I went back into Water God, because apparently Full Cuss was in there. Oh, wait. If I'm gonna use this, I need to go up here. There we go. Alright. Looks like I had the blue mystery data here. In Yum Land. Netopia has two. Super armor and HP memory. I already know I got super armor because that was in here from behind the skull door. The HP memory I probably got too. Like, I could buy an HP memory, but nah. Let's check up here. Can't get behind that door. Not that I I don't think it would have anything. Energy bomb. Well, actually, the only blue mystery data that I missed is apparently the teddy bear in Mail's house is a jack import. But for some reason, I can't access it. And I don't know why. But I took a look at what's available there, and it doesn't seem like it's that great. Oh, you know what? Now that I'm actually thinking about it. It must be a part of her scenario in the t from the tournament. That must be it. Maybe part of her story mode in the in the tournament requires you to actually go into the the stuffed doll, and that's why I don't have it. If that's the case, that makes sense why I don't have it. But I, again, I looked at the rewards. They're not that great. So it's not a big deal. Like, that's the only... That and the antenna from Cold Man Scenario are, like, the only ones that I couldn't really get. Uh, it seems like I can't really you know, run from these. Too strong, I guess. Oh no, panel grab. However will I escape? You go into the stuff door? Okay, so that's how you get in there. Okay. I was wondering why I couldn't get in. But if it's from her scenario, I guess that that's how that's the explanation. Okay, nothing there. Yeah, I'm being very, uh, careful, like, I'm, I'm reading these out loud, be like, area, this area has two, and they can come, and it has this and this, you know, so, if you really need a video that shows all of, all of the mystery data, or at least tells you where, roughly what's here, just to double check, you can use this, I guess, as a reference, kind of. Okay, Sharo. So super armor, HP, memory, it looks like I have. Sharo has an HP memory and HP plus 200. Let's see. Let's see where I wanna go. Oh, please let me leave. Yeah, okay. 
Might as well grab this. Nothing there. That might have been one. This is for the... The sea slider. Master. Repair. Oh, I need that. Come, Guardian. way. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I found, I already know where that first blue mystery data was, and the other one was at the skull door. Please let me l run. I have to go to left. This way. Up and around. Good. And then this was the skull door that had one of the blue mystery data. Magnet bolt B. Okay. Alright, I think we fully checked out Sharo. Now let's run to Netfrica, who where it has two mystery data, jungle and barrier 100 w which I'm pretty sure I got both, but I know I got jungle. That's for sure. I know I have that. Yeah, I was just like like thinking to myself, I wish there was like some online like let's just say checklist that you could pull up where it's like, "Hey, once you get a mystery data, just mark it on this website and it will remember the information. So you can constantly just keep a checklist ready to go. Because I think this game would really need that a blue mystery data, purple mystery data list. That would be very nice, actually. Nothing down here. Oh, there's a green over here. Might as well grab it. Throw that here. Okay. Eh, not that useful. All right. And up here was jungle. This was jungle. Go down here. I don't see any blues. That might have been over there, actually. Top right. Bug fragment. That's very nice. Need more of those. Uh, we can actually kill them all. Two white shots will do it. You could have the same thing for filling out the chip and PA libraries as well. Yeah, exactly. Although, like, the thing is, when it comes to chips and program advances, you're not locked out, you know? You could get them all on your final playthrough, you know? It, the program events, like, the blue mystery data and purple mystery data really matter because... Like, it's to not have to do multiple more playthroughs than necessary. Basically what I'm doing now, hey, I am playing, I'm doing the first run, I want to make sure to get all blues and purples as I go. So I'm just going to mark them all off as soon as I find them. Chip and program advances, I mean, you can have the list, sure. However, like, you're not locked out, you know? That's more the thing I'm worried about. Oh yeah, you could totally make one. Uh, can I run? Yay. Nothing in shard. Okay. Undernet. There's one here. 
Reg up one. If I knew how to code, I might even do it. Yeah, I don't know how to code, so I, I couldn't help out with that. But that's an idea that someone could take and make. Have it for free, I don't care. Makes things easier. Slow gauge, fast gauge, north wind, static. Don't need any of this. I mean, eventually we'll, we will, but I want to save my money. Zenny. Okay. I could get them both. Alright. Dang it. I used Invis at the wrong time. Uh, this has gone worse. There we go. I need to use Invis sooner. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I was thorough. Can I run? Okay, good. This. Although, like, there are some uh, green mystery data. I was actually looking through. Like, you know, you could get certain chips from, uh, or specific chip codes from uh, green mystery data. And which ones are available are determined on which playthrough you're on. So, yeah, you could make a checklist if you want. But that that's also, like, do you really want that many of that particular code? You know what I mean? Not everyone would really need it. Got one. Get in the poison. Or die to the Mega Buster. That works too. Actually, do I have two of those? No, I only have one of those. Like, that's an example right there. If I wanted to grind for Recover 80 Stars, I would have to probably do it now. But that's, that's one of them. But then again, you could probably get better stuff. All right. I think I got the reg up. Undernet Area 2 has an expand memory and a speed max. Well, we could probably check for the speed max. Yeah, that's what I have right here. And the expand memory, it looks like I already have. So I think we're... I think we're good, actually. Yeah, I think we... I, I don't think we need to explore this. I think I got it. We'll double check, but we'll come back to... Uh, we'll, we're going to Area 3. But yeah, I think we're fine here. So far, I haven't really found, like, a great money grinding spot. But obviously this is area round one. Not gonna find it here. Again, how does being invisible affect like whether or not you get confused by sound? It really shouldn't. That's probably where the expand memory was. Okay, what I can do is this, and we set up Gun Soul 3. Gotta be careful. One more. 
get out of here. Dark line. Oh, I didn't get that. That's a new chip. Keeping that. Untrap. And we got hole. Did I have that? Uh, I guess I did. Oh, dark line was a mega chip. Turns all rows into holes. Oh, okay. It's just a better hole. Okay. I didn't realize Dark Line was a mega chip. All right, got lucked out there. That was probably one of the one of the five evil chips that uh, we need to get into. What was it, Dark Nebula? Eventually. Can we do something similar? I mean. I think we can make this work. Okay. Oh, you had to recover. Okay. So if I want to make this work... Now I need to hit him with something else. And I can't use this. Because I'll destroy the mystery data. Bubbler's not going to help. Wide shot's not going to help. Okay. There's got to be... I, I'm, I think I have to aim for another boomerang. It's all for the mystery data. Can't use it, any of this. Can't use any of this right here. <sighs> really? I'm trying to think if there was like another like double soul that I could have had that probably would have been able to hit him. And I can't think of anything at the moment. <laughs> right now, I'm just waiting for another boomerang. I don't think Guardian would have help. There we go. Boomerang. Perfect. Buck frags. Totally worth it. Totally worth it. Okay, I think we're good. Oh, I could totally get this. That was the grind. Uh, we're just doing cleanup, hot corn dog. Come on, attack the middle. I have not moved an inch. There we go. We're just checking blue mystery data and stuff like that. Popcorn dog. We're almost done. I already have all the purple mystery days. We already checked most of the blues. We're doing the we're checking the last few. Got a bug frag. Okay. Undernet area three has two blue mystery data. HP memory and recover 120Q. I'm pretty sure 120Q is currently in my folder. Yep. But we'll We'll double check. We will have to double back here anyway. So it's not a big deal which way we check first. But yeah, once we're done with this, we're going to the final dungeon. There's more blue mystery data in there, and, you know, we'll actually just beat the boss, you know. Do all that stuff. Uh... I think we can do this. Get rid of the sand trap. There, I got rid of one guy. Perfect. 
Medjo, okay, I already have this. Okay. Grab that. We'll head to Undernet 4 first. Then we'll double back to Undernet 6. Well, how's it going on your end, Hawkwind Dog? What's been going on? Okay, if I do this, it's 140. Oh, and I got them both, too. Element flip. I don't think I have that one. Getting chips along the way. Okay, I'm not seeing anything. Uh, we'll double back. Okay. We're doubling back to Area 3 anyway. Area 4. Has an HP memory and custom one, which I'm pretty sure I have. It's over here. Dead end. I probably have it. Dead end. Okay. Oh, please. Oh, no. Nothing? Okay. Um. Okay. And this should block the wind. Well, I pulled the fan closer. Because that's going to help me, clearly. I didn't need Invis. Why did I... Uh... Okay. I'm not seeing any blue. Triple crack. Okay. Good there. Dead end. Nothing there. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not really gonna look through those. Got here, dead end. That was probably one of the blues, now that I'm thinking about it. Dead end. It didn't really matter which chip I used. Now I'm thinking about it. Done. And dead ends. Okay. Green mystery data. Bug frag? Okay, we'll take it. Take it. Seven hours of classic luck syndrome. Oh, you're talking about um, Battlefront, right? Hope that goes well. Hope they didn't mess it up. <laughs> Get over here. Oh, I remember a safe spot from, like, these hockey pop guys just stay, like, three squares away from him. And he won't, he won't hit you. Yeah, I'm now remembering that. You were another bug frag trader. Air shoes, navi plus 20, anti-magic. Get in three... Attack max, we're gonna need that eventually, signal red. We're gonna have to eventually, like, buy everything out. And luckily, we already did this. Checking the coffin had this nebula ID, so it's all good. Oh, 
Oh, I'm not gonna hit them all. Probably should have made sure. Oh well. It works out. Let's grab the Invis. We can have two hockey bucks. According to some beta testers, the creators who got first access, there are some audio problems, and it seems online hosts will pay will play on lower FPS. Hmm. However, it's overall not too bad, basically. No loading time, and they fixed a lot of other bugs that were in the canal game. That's kind of cool, so only it only needs like a few extra fixes, and it's good to go. Sounds like. Okay, I think we're good on Area 4. I think we found everything. Okay! Shade Man! Wasn't wanting to fight you, but okay. Um, wasn't expecting this. Uh, I don't even think I can use Guardian against him. A proper fight with Shade Man. That would have been my best shot. Oh, and his sonar hits through Invis. Okay, program advance, but I'm probably not going to hit him. And I don't know what happened. Yeah, I'm probably not making this. Yeah, I was not prepared for this. Okay, well, there was nothing I needed. And I can see that dead end I was going to double check. I think we're good. Yeah, we don't need to be here. Yeah, I was not prepared for Shade Man. Yeah, he pops up when you do the Django side quest. So, uh, how he works is once you hit him with basically anything, it won't do any damage, but he turns into those four bats. One of those bats is actually him. And that's how you're supposed to actually do damage to him. I think Gun Soul will still work on him, though. Because it's light. I think that might be the exception. But no, I, I was not expecting to fight Shade Man. I remember Sh be Shade Man being a pain in the butt to deal with. Okay, he's going up. And, you know, there's that green mystery data that you fight with him. I think if you want to get one of the evil chips, I think you need to make sure that doesn't get destroyed. I could be wrong, but I think you have to make sure of that. Don't see another blue. I think we've made sure we fully checked. Area 3. Oh, come on. How did I miss that? I'll just let him attack me. There we go. Okay. Now, area six. 
the whole star chip and attack plus one. I think there was one right there. I, re I think I remember getting it. And there's nothing in Area 5, because we can only go to a small section of Area 5. Doesn't really matter. Too bad it doesn't go all the way through all the enemies. Once it hits one, that's it. Element Ice, I didn't have that one. Put that in. Sweet. Green mystery data. Let's go down here first. Uh, okay. I think I can maybe use Guardian. Oh, uh, we got them both attacking. We're good. Triple delete. Okay. Let's go this way. What? Molly, come on. Jeez. What, you want more attention? She's a needy dog. She's a very needy dog. No, no. Come on. No. Come on. You're fine. The collection comes with PS4 and PS5 version as well. Oh, that's nice. If you want to play solo, you can play the PS5 version. If you want to play with your brother, you can get to the PS4 version so you can use the PS4 controller for split screen. Oh, very cool. That's very cool. Molly, down. 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 Where's your bomb? Did you finish your bomb? Where's your squirrel? Where's your squirrel? Um, go with this for now. I need an attack plus to KO them both in one shot. She found her squirrel. Uh, dead end. Green mystery data. Bug frag? Okay, we'll take it. Program shop. This is the one where you pay money for. Okay. Oil body? Eventually. Float shoe? Reflect. Okay, we'll buy it. We're buying Reflect. I was not planning on that, but we'll see if it's as good as it is in Battle Network uh, 3. Let's rearrange. Now, I do have Spin White. I wonder if there's a way to shrink programs. Uh, I think I lose all my HP, but that's okay. Custom one. Can I get this in? Yes. Yes, I can. Still get custom one in here. Perfect. If there is a compression thing, I don't know how to get, use it right now. We don't need collect at the moment. Bug stop. We're good. I still have speed max, so I'm good on that. HP. No, okay, that's what we're going with. We'll see how good uh, Reflect is. Because maybe it's not good. Now yeah, we're going to keep it. Reflect was too good in Battle Network 3. Can't go in here. Okay. We'll take the other route. Let's go this way. This just led to a dead end, right? I 
I can't time it right. I don't think this is the best fight to try out Reflect. <laughs> can't get it to work. I do want to test it out, though. Bug Frax? Okay, we'll take it. Uh... Attack plus one. Okay, I missed that one. So, yeah, it's a good thing we double-checked in here. That one's hard to find. Can I throw this in? I can throw this in. There we go. And... Whole star? I'm not seeing it. Okay. That one's, like, really hidden. I think there was one like that in Battle Network 2 as well. You know what? Let's grab this. Might as well use this, too. Got rid of one. I'm gonna try it on the. I'm gonna try it on the needles. So you know what I can do. Let's heal up. Thank you, grass panels. Fully heal. All right. It does work. It does work on them. Ooh, if it's anything like Battle Network 3, it's 100 damage. It's so good. Counter 2. I think I have that. All right. I think we got all blue mystery data. I double checked everywhere. And we found, like, what, a good four blue mystery data? Alright, I'll take it. Unless there's anything else I need to double check, I think we're good to go and we can just head out. How much money do I have? Nothing. Okay. Uh, I have one unlocker on me. We'll be fine. Assuming, uh, subships carry over, which I think they do. I think we're ready to go fight the, the final boss. There was nothing here. There was no extra area for this, uh, for Naxa, apparently. I'll double check. There, there wasn't one listed. You think there would be, though? Who's the final boss? We're gonna find out. All we know is we need to go into the asteroid because it's a uh, space station at satellite thing. We're gonna do the final dungeon. Basically, I just entered the final dungeon. I'm like, nope, out of here, and left. <laughs> All right. So there are three blue mystery datas in this section. Let's make sure to grab those before moving on. Okay. Of course we get into a random encounter. Anything useful? Hmm. I guess we'll charge up bubblers. Oh no, it's part of its turn to lava. One more. Too bad the attack plus doesn't affect uh, the charge shot for for Aqua Soul. I wonder why. 
Okay, one blue mystery data. Get in one. Okay. Set this up. We can use these. Yeah, it kind of sucks that Aquaman's Charge Buster is still at 20. And I guess there's no way to power that up. You think it would have, though. Like, that That feels a little lame. It's that weak. There's a huge magnetic disturbance. Careful, Mega Man. I think I just mash A. Nothing's happening. This was not explained. Yeah, so you're supposed to pass these in the order it tells you to. Okay, I think I saw another blue mystery data. Let's go ahead and get rid of you. Actually, I'm probably going to want to use Invis a lot less. So I can reflect. I need to see what that damage actually is. There's three. Okay, blue mystery data. High cannon D. Don't want to take that path. And once you pass through all of them in the right order, they float up. So you can now just pass underneath them like normal. Okay. And... Can't check that blue mystery data, now can I? Um... Now let's try flame line. I wanna try to... Do that, there we go. Oh, I can't reflect this guy, can I? Oh, there we go. I lucked out. 100 damage at the very least. HP memory. Okay. Yeah, that's right. Heading to area 2. Make a save. Can't do anything there yet. That's a four. Bloom, three mystery data. Wide blade K. Okay. Very good. Two more to find. Give this uh, armor some heat stroke. Give them all heat stroke. Use the power of Sunny D to defeat my enemies. Reg up three. There's one more somewhere. Alright. Actually, let's move down here. Reflect. 100 damage. Okay. Hundred damage for reflect. That's just like Battle Network 3. That is very useful. Although I wonder how many enemies it really works against. Mashing buttons works. Do I want to go this way? Three. Mm. Got 
That was a mistake. I see the problem that I made. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. Are you... Really, Molly? You need to go out again? I just let you out already. Oh my god. I don't think I could reflect you even if I wanted to. Too bad I don't have, like, a grass stage or something. Well, at the very least, what's... Um, Aqua Soul? Yeah, we'll, we'll just go Aqua Soul. Oh, that does work! Never mind, it's not a breaker. Perfect. Really, Molly? Let's find the bl next blue mystery data, move on to the next area, then I guess I'll let her out again. Okay, we're missing one blue mystery data somewhere. Where is it? There it is. Zenny. Well, geez, now that I know that, like, I can, like, get rid of some of these guys, like how I do. Dang it. Um... Perfect. And charge shot. Area three. <sighs> Molly, you seriously need to go outside again? I guess so. Be right back.
Okay. We are back. Swap it back over. All right. Th uh, three blue mystery data here. Nothing too special, but, you know, still need to gather them when I can. I saw one up there. Can't get there yet. Counter two. All right. Not bad. I don't use counter, but it could probably be useful. To someone at the very least. Oh, how do I want to handle this? No matter what, I'd be losing out. Is this just the amount of hits or the amount of damage? Must be damage. Worked out. Boy bomb. Okay, I didn't get that yet. That's good. That's the next way to the next area. Let's see. That's three over there. Where's two? There's four. Button mash, so we don't get sucked up into the void or the black hole, whatever. Let's get rid of the boy bomb first. That takes priority. Next, focus on this guy. 30 damage first charge shot. One more. Perfect. I wonder if you could block the explosion from boy bomb. Bug frag. All right, one more blue mystery data. Need to find the fifth one. Or fourth, third one, jeez. There it is. Hmm. Like this. I had a feeling I just get Oh, right. Uh, causes uh, these to break. The panels. Man, I wish I had Guardian sooner. Would have been better. You know, I probably need the circle gun chip. Or whatever that enemy drops. HP plus 100. Last of those in the area. area, the final area, there's four blue mystery data. We'll grab that and then we can safely fight the final boss. Area four. Last area. Four blue mystery data. Let's go and that's the last of it too. As far as I'm aware. First one. Full energy. We're probably going to want to use that up. They pur purposely give you that one because you're... You know, you've you gone through a big dungeon. You kind of need the... You know, y you really need to be able to heal up for the final boss, right? Oh. 
Ah, reflect works. Okay. Gonna heal up. Reflect works on explosions. Another heal? No. Oh, I could have grabbed the air hockey. Perfect. Okay, well, there's the first one. No, not there yet. You got attack plus one. I can't fit that in. But it's nice to have another one. We'll go with air hockey. There we go. There's circle gun. Okay. Uh, great. I was about to say, but no. Gravity well needs to show up. All right, there we go. Circle gun. If I didn't have it before, I have it now. Okay, let's find the second one. There we go. We need to find three. Reflect is still so good. What? Whoa. Hold on. Messed that up. Almost messed that up. Far Sword V. We need to get down there. And last. Recover 120F. You know what? I'd be getting a 150, but at least if I get both of these at the same time, I could just grab them. That should be all the blue mystery data. What? See what you done, Molly? You see what you did? You caused the gravity thing. That's what happens. Where is the blue? Okay, I need to go this way. Up and around. First, get rid of Bomb Boy. That didn't... It would have worked. Yeah, I guess I'm using Invis. Yeah, well, I'll heal up. Why not? Definitely can't stand in front of him. He will hit me. doing got that done power sunny d okay uh down and left oh i see now we need to go up and around for four <laughs> Battle Network 2 wouldn't let you do that. If a, a projectile was already, like, there, it wouldn't spawn. But Battle Network 4 was like, nah. If a projectile's there, go ahead and summon it. <laughs> oh, I was gonna say, I didn't complete it. No. This stupid thing. Of course, another random encounter. Yeah, we'll get rid of him now.
Might as well heal up while I have the chance. Swimming in place is truly a moment in history. Yeah, I mean, when... When space is involved, you can basically just swim in place anywhere you want. Oh, dang it. I needed to... Okay, we need to go up and around again. Stop his healing. One more. Can we heal? We can heal. Perfect. Oh, down and around. Okay, we need to go up here, take a left. Another random encounter, because the game just won't stop. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Fine. I'll go with this. Up here and to the right. We got all the blue mystery data. All of it. Except for the areas that I couldn't get to. Like the antenna and Roll's teddy bear. Alright. How much HP do I have? Ah, we're close enough. Lan, it's a warp hole. Regal's Navi must be inside. So you come. Show yourself. Show yourself, Laser Man. We meet again, Mega Man. The asteroid controlling. Control room is inside that warp hole. I'll ask you again. Will you wield the, your power with us in the syndicate? You have but two choices. Come with me into the warp hole and rule the world. Or be torn limb from limb while being stranded in the void. I've already answered I've already answered you. I will not be a part of your evil. Of your evil. Just evil. Okay. As I expected. Suspected. Stupid Navi. Your side is due to failure. I'm not like I was before. My friends have shown me true love. The power of friendship uh, comes in again. My body is full of the warmth of their souls. Ha! The warmth of souls indeed. Listen to me. That feeble power is no match for the power of evil. I'll teach you. Lan, he's coming. Show him the power of good. Uh, prepare to become space dust. There we go, laser man. And we start with guardian. Sweet. Uh, let's go wood man. And we'll see how much we can actually do with a Reflect. Well, that's a good starting move. Yeah, go ahead. Try to hit me now. <laughs> oh, that stops time. That wouldn't have worked. Like messing up. Why am I not pulling this off? Wait, something's wrong. 
Wait, how come I can't reflect? Something's not something's not right. Well. And that hits through Invis. It's a good thing I saved because something's not right. Yeah, we'll take it. We'll take it. It's fine. For some reason, Reflect is not working. Or I'm just not good at the game. <laughs> Both are valid. B the blue laser deletes Navicus programs? That's dumb. Okay. No wonder something was off. I didn't know that. I didn't know Laser Man could do that. Okay. Okay. Kind of wish there was a more obvious tell for that. Dark laser. Oh, he just has regen. Okay. I don't know if there's a way to stop that. Yeah, I'm not dealing with that laser, man. Get out of here. Get out of here. The power of re Reflect will just always stop you. Have you tried throwing a banana peel? Hmm. I haven't tried that. We haven't become Gorilla Soul Mega Man. I mean, or DK Soul Mega Man, I guess, would be the proper one. Uh, uh, it's over. I everything. Mega Man, your hate for me will allow your dark soul to be reborn. <laughs> I can even see it deep inside your body, your dark soul. Ah! Ah! That voice. <laughs> Definitely need water after trying that voice. <laughs> My dark soul. <laughs> Lan, this will blow our last chance to avoid the asteroid. <coughs> what do you mean? The plan originally called for sending my Navi. My Navi would succeed for sure. A Navi like yours couldn't possibly control the asteroid. The planet's doomed thanks to your stupid reasoning. <laughs> we won't know until we try. We won't ever give up. Mega Man, make for the control room. We must change the asteroid's course. Okay, Lane, I'm going. I think now we want to... Well, definitely save. Now I think we want to use the full energy. Alright. Wait, hold on. What do you say? Lan, the magnetic field in this area is fluctuating too. Too much for us to save the game. Do you want to go on? All right, then, here I go. So wait, saving the game is something that happens within the world itself? They know what saving the game means? Anyway, yeah, there are viruses here. I don't really want to get hit, but I probably will be getting hit. Yeah, I got the double delete. Alright, here we go. Lan, that must be the control system. Wonder how we can get in there. Ah, and we were so close! Too bad I can't fly. Evil energy detected. 
Careful, Mega Man. You're not alone. I am the OS for the anti-planet missile. Or the anti-planet missile. Duo. Anti-planet missile? What do you got against our planet? The only command in memory is to judge and destroy evil. A massive amount of evil's been detected on your planet. I mean, we had... We had World 3 twice, we had Grave, we have Nebula. I mean, I think it's fair. It is you humans. You are highly intelligent, but have evil in your hearts. I must punish your planet according to my program. What? I'm not gonna let you do that. This ends here. How interesting. Let's just see how powerful you really are. Do you have the power to wipe out your own evil? Boo. Mega Man, behind you! Try my Dark Soul. Bring it on. Show me what you got. Listen up, Mega Man. This is a battle against yourself. Okay, operate away. Leave it to me. Here we go, Mega Man. First, a battle with ourselves. Basically, we can do anything we can already do. That includes chips and I think Navi Customizer programs, too. So, I think we'll start with Aqua Soul. Although, I'm not sure if he can, like, soul change. I think that's, like, the only thing he can't do. Come, Guardian. And he has undershirt, so... Oh, uh, great. In this. I'm making things worse for myself for putting electric to... So there we go. We got him. Easy. We did it! So you managed to defeat the evil within. A fine battle. However, you always succeeded in rep uh, repressing your evilness. It is gone for now, but it will likely reawaken one day. In short, you are not powerful enough to defeat evil. Living, creature, living creatures all have both good and evil in their hearts. No duh. The important thing is whether or not you can fight your own evil when it wakens. My mission is to destroy evil. I need to find this evil energy, if you will. Even if it means annihilating the human race. I won't let you do that. This ends here. I am only following my program. I must destroy you because of the evil you have within. He's just kind of dumb. He's like Goku in that sense, but without having to crash land to get brain damage. Yeah, he was just born with brain damage. Battle body. Right arm. Left arm. Duo battle form. Oh no, he has horns! He's Galactus! Lan, I know, we gotta save the planet. Here we go, Mega Man. Last routine set, execute. I'm pretty sure you said last routine, like, three other times for three different games. I must destroy all evil. Alright, final battle against Duo. And look, we could go with Wood Soul. Uh, actually... Air hockey doesn't work here. Actually, Magnum Bolt doesn't either. Well, that sucks. Anyway. Let's go with Wood Soul. Every time it lands in, he goes back to the middle column, he doesn't attack. I could do that. And prep a tornado, basically. Oh, I messed that up. I might lose. Mm, 
Okay, let's use Gunsoul and Invis. Who knew Duo can uh, lose to the power of the sun? Oh, this might be bad. And that didn't work. Oh, that's such a weird... The ring thing, I forgot. Oh, I forgot about that. It has this very specific pattern. Okay. Final boss again. So, I think this is the first plot... First final boss that I've done during these streams that I actually lost to. I didn't get him. I didn't beat him on my first attempt. Granted, to be fair, I have way less HP than I probably should have in a normal Battle Network playthrough. So that doesn't help. So yeah, this one might actually be challenging because I I should have way more HP me memories. <laughs> Alright, let's try it again. Aqua Soul for the power up. Oh, you used your own Guardian, which means you hit yourself. You're not that smart. Uh, he has his own invis, so I can't hit him. Actually, I'll use my own. That way I'm safe. Unless he uses Guardian again, or I bring my own. I could have healed, but we'll save for wide shot. Done. Yeah, Dark Soul is not that hard, honestly. At least with my folder. Duo is, uh... Yeah. Okay. Let's get rid of the air hockeys. Yeah, what is that, 160? If, if the full tornado hits? This is why I like using... This is why I like playing Blue Moon to fight Duel. Wood Soul does a lot of damage. That's probably good. Um, let's save those for later. Let's get Invis and Boomerang. Oh, he's starting to punch twice. Oh, now's the perfect time for... Uh, the power of Sunny D. Okay. Aqua Soul. I only get one more free hit. Oh, he blocked that. Nope. Yeah, I almost had it. I was close, though. I was kind of trapped. Alright. Try that again. I was close. I was very close. Michael Mega Man can't be big. I know, right? Why can't we get, like, a giant battle armor? Just go with this. So, I am confused about Duo's existence, honestly. Like, really thinking about the timeline here. I'm going to be that guy right now. So, the reason why this timeline exists is that... The original Dr. Light decided to go with K-1. 
computers instead of robotics. That's why we got. Uh, that's how we got into this timeline. But how does that affect Duo? He's from space, from another planet. They kept that backstory, but why is he a, a Navi? That's what I don't understand. Yeah, I don't understand how he's a Navi. Like, how does Dr. Light changing what uh, field of study he wants to go into affect whether or not Duo's a robot or a Navi? Okay. I mean, make it make sense, Capcom. Make it make sense. <clears throat> Duo could have been really interesting with a lot more development, but they just kind of plop him in there. Yeah, he's just, like, in an asteroid, like, in a satellite from space. They don't really do much with him. They could have done something with him, but they didn't. That's... I'm pretty sure this game got rushed. I mean, it's obvious that it did. Yeah, and also, like, the plot, like, is non-existent with this game. If it had a little bit more... Re oh, that just sucked. Hey, Act, how's it going? Yeah, I can't, I am excited for One Piece this week. Because I really wanted to know what happened, and then they skipped a week. Well, how's it going, Act? What's going on? We're fighting the final boss! Uh, we'll save all that for later. We'll get rid of these. Oh, no. I think I'm dead. I am dead. Man, I, now I wish I had air shoes. Guardian, we can hit him with Guardian. Uh, wait, no, let's use this for now. While well, I can power it up. Damn. Am I winning? No, this is my third loss <laughs> against the final boss. Again, when it, in comparison to a normal Battle Network game, I am severely under, like, prepared in terms of HP. So that's part of the problem, but uh, that's this game's design. That's how this game was made. But what's going on, Act? Did you finally finish uh, the DLC for Effie and Gage? Or are you still on that final chapter? Try this again. Gotta fight my evil self first, which is very easy. Very easy to beat my doppelganger. Oh, perfect. That was like the perfect spot for him to be at. Come on, reflect. There we go, got him. Beat it last weekend. Very nice. Third time it was a charm. So, uh, if I'm correct, you said you were going to be going through Shadows of Valentia next? Uh, oh, I don't get to keep my counter. That's lame. Okay. Hmm. Let's go with Vulcan, I guess.
Dang it. Let's get these out of the way, I guess. Oh, that doesn't work either. A lot of my folder doesn't work against Duo. Yeah, we'll throw in an Invis. Shadows of Valentia. Very cool. Very cool. Um, you know what? While we have the time, <coughs> let's just get... Before, you know, I weaken him too much, let's just get rid of a lot of my useless chips. While I have the time. This will not work. Wait. No, you know what? Let's take a second. Let's heal. And then we'll use Invis. At least I'm doing... Ah, oh, this chip. This one. Okay. I'm currently trapped. Okay. The soul. Let's start with the white shots. Oh no, I could get hit. Okay. I messed that up. So use the power of Sunny D. Bubble spread. At least his movement is very predictable. I'll give it that. Okay, now I'm safe. Okay. Get rid of these. have one more heal. Nope. Didn't make it work. Alright, I think I need to rearrange my folder. Let's see. Uh, that could work. Let's see. I could throw in the kind of cannons and get my program advance. Same thing with spreader. I'd be relying on program advances though. Same thing with Heat Shot. Uh, Thunder's not that great. Flame Line doesn't work. Pile Driver won't work. That won't work either. Twin Fane, I only have two sets. Can't program advance, but I could throw these in. Twin Fane's not that bad, so that'd be damage. These won't work. These won't work. Oh, that's a program advanced right there. Okay. Static? No. Mini bomb. Energy bomb, not gonna work. Not really. Not that I can think of. We could get Life Sword back. That's 400 damage. White Blades. No. Cuss Swords. Far Sword. I have two of them. Hmm, I don't know. I could get rid of my air hockeys. I do think boomerang is very useful to go into wood soul. Circle gun? I don't have that many. Snakes. Eh... Uh. He doesn't always send in that many holes, and even then, like, let's just say that's four. That's 80 damage. It's not really worth it. I think Magnum might actually work. 130? You know what? Yeah. Let's use... Let's get Magnum in here. Uh, let's get rid of... First, let's get rid of Flame Line. I might get rid of Blizzard. Eh, I could use Aqua Soul for that. 
Okay. Mm, time bombs are not worth it. Mine's not worth it. Guard, no. I keep forgetting I have Reflect. I could have probably survived some of these attacks. Um, I could throw in more Invis. Anti-Sword, copy damage, jealousy, full cuss. Okay. Uh, I need to get rid of more stuff. Nah, uh, not Circle Gun. I don't have that much for a Circle Gun. You know what? Let's... Let's get in Life Sword again. What else can I... What else can I replace? Yeah, let's get rid of my Vulcan. And... Gunsoul can stay. Oh, right. I need to get rid of Air Hockey. What else can I get rid of? Not Flame Line. Fine. We're gonna try to go Program Advance... Alright, that might be okay. I'm gonna throw in my Boomerang Star. Where I, I think I passed it. There we go. That might be a better folder. Alright, let's try it. A lot of my chips just wouldn't hit him. They don't work. Now, I have a lot of program advances set up, so... And there's no way to add, and I already have my custom. Well, we get to see this work in action. I messed that up. Okay. <sighs> Wait, okay. Fine. Try that again. Alright, fight my evil self first. Right, Molly? Yeah, I know. I guess we'll start with these. I still don't really have Junk Soul set up. Gonna check out my... Gonna check out my FX VOD? Uh, good, yeah, uh, have a good day, uh, act. My FX squad. Fells in your lock. Oh, okay. <laughs> right. Should be, like, the final video in that playlist. Um. Do note that, uh, I was playing on normal, so it's definitely a lot different. But I did, it wasn't technically, I technically did lose, like, once or twice. And I had to use my crystals. Well, yeah. Go take a look. That's what's there for. At least we get a full heal. Now that I realize that. Okay. Skill issue. Pretty much, yeah. I can get that to work, but it's a tight window. It's a very tight window. I can set this up. Perfect. I had to make sure to hit him with that when he's not going to use the laser.
Alright. I thought there would be more of a delay. Okay, he's attacking twice. Heat shots. Two heat shots. Two... Oh, dang it. Um... You know what? I don't... I'm not going to use any of it. Oh, I forgot about that move. That was weird. Alright. Aqua Soul it is. Turn up to max and hope they carry, yeah. Well, actually, in Fel Xenolog, you couldn't train to max. Remember, you were kind of just using preset levels. I'm not saying that went better, but... I did kind of lock myself because I'm like, Oh, I have multiple program fences set up and ready to go, but I don't want to spend more chips. Ugh. And Junk Soul will not help. Actually, the benefit of getting Junk Soul instead is to have Recycle. A, a chance of more Guardians, I guess. Reflect for the win. I guess I'll use my own Invis. Since I can't do anything. L, M, and N. Pit Ring. 200 damage. We'll wait for him to... Done. You know, at least Duo has the courtesy to fully heal us. I'm assuming Duo's doing that. I don't know how we're getting the full heal. Okay. Same thing again. Well, I managed to get the hit. Some screen. Oh, good timing. What do we got? Guardian, it is. Oh, not many break. Broke, whatever. 200 damage? Good. Luckily, that ring pa pattern's the same. In this, I guess. One more Mega Buster will do it. There we go. Done. Beat him. Easy. First try. Clearly. Dude, don't back the video up. <laughs> Again, I still don't understand how Duo is a Navi instead of a robot. Timeline-wise, it makes no sense. Oh, 
did you beat my battle form? But it is too late. Gravity is already pulling the missile toward your planet. It is too late to change its course. Just wait and see. We won't ever give up. Then give it a try. I am interested in seeing what you got. You should cross the bridge and then use the control system. Only one hour until it enters the atmosphere. Hurry, Mega Man. Okay. Man, we would have had more time if I didn't run around getting blue mystery data. Good thing we could stop time. If I turn this... Ugh, dang, it's heavy. Ugh, you can do it. As Mega Man fought for his life, Nexa told the world about the incoming asteroid and Mega Man's heroic efforts. With only one hour Im to impact, the sudden announcement caused mass panic. I mean, it would. Oh no! That asteroid's gonna kill us all! This place isn't gonna be pro This place isn't gonna protect us from an asteroid strike. We're history. Mega Man's giving it his best shot, but what can one Navi do? Had I known about this, I'd marry long ago. <laughs> this is terrible. What are the officials doing? All you think about is yourselves. At this very moment, Mega Man's out there risking his life. Well, it's not like we could do anything about it. All we could do is sit here and wait for the asteroid to strike. Mega Man's just some kid's navvy. What are the chances of him helping us? We're most likely doomed, but we can't. But we can't give up hope. Oh, it's Sal. Miss Sal. Mega Man's struggling for his life inside the asteroid. Yet you guys have given up all hope. Nothing good comes from of despair. We mustn't give up hope while Mega Man's still fighting back. Isn't there something we can do? Yeah, we gotta help Mega Man somehow. <laughs> Good idea. Even if our voices don't reach Mega Man, he might sense our support somehow. We're gonna use the spirit bomb, basically. Mega Man, go for it! Mega Man, you can do it! Mega Man! <laughs> Basically, our, our solution is the spirit bomb, I guess. What are you guys going to do? I'm going to root for Mega Man. He's the only one that can save our planet. This is the fourth time where he's attempting this. Mega Man! Mega Man! Mega Man! Me you can do it! Don't give up! Mega Man! There we go. Meanwhile, led by the net battlers at the tournament, the shouts from all over the world were conveyed to Mega Man. Notopia Coliseum Avenue. Mega Man, fight, fight! Don't let us down! Mega Man! You can do it! Hey guys, that Navi Mega Man is gonna win. He was amazing when I saw him at the tournament. I really believe he'll be able to save us. We believe Mega Man! Again, like, just shonen anime tropes, don't you think? There's no better Navi than Mega Man. You must have faith in him. Keep it up! Mega Man! Mega Man! Mega Man, go for it! Don't give up! We're gonna... We're gonna sit through all this, aren't we? <laughs> Netfrica. Oh, it's Mr. Famous. Mega Man, protect Mother Nature! Don't let us down! Mega Man's the best Navi in the world! Go, go, Mega Man! Have no fear. Mega Man won't let us down. All we could do is believe in him. We must shout at the top of our lungs! It gets repetitive after a while. <laughs> Sharo. No! An asteroid strike would make this planet way too hot! I couldn't stand that. Save us, Mega Man! Charo is a cold country, but our hearts are on fire. Hang in there, Mega Man! Three cheers for Mega Man! Mr. Mega Man! Yeah, Mega Man! Ugh, this is getting tiring. <laughs> Repetitive. It's all hell. Go, Mega Man! We're all behind you! What the? Mega Man! Mega Man! Oh, 
faulty wire wire uh, right I can't speak faulty wires I guess what's going on why have a big cutoff from Mega Man seems a power cable has snapped the high voltage must have did him in there's no way to operate him now no at this point there's only one way to revive him there's still hope we must bypass the snap cable to restore power. Like this! Ah! Regal! Don't get me wrong. I shall create a world of utter evil. Ah! Regal! He's pulling a lamb. Mega Man! Mega Man! Hang in there! Hmm? No good. I can't move. But I'll never give up. Ugh. Give up already. 30 minutes to atmospheric entry. It's been 30 minutes? Okay. What's this? Why, the, why is the atmosphere vibrating like that? Vibration sensor on. Mega... Mega... Mega Man... Mega Man! Human voices? That can't be. They're rooting for me. They're transmitting their power to me. Somehow. Rawr! What's this power welling up within Mega Man? They must be awakening some sort of latent power within him. Lan, lend me the power to save you all! Mega Man, you ready? Full synchro! No hub style. Go for it! We did it! Mega Man, now I have seen what you can do. Your planet barely escaped destruction. I will delay punishing you for now. In the meantime, I will slumber as I travel the universe. Next time I pass by your planet, decades or even centuries from now, you will again be judged. Then we'll see if then we'll see if need to be punished. Now be gone, little warrior. You know, that's a setup for Star Force if I ever saw if I ever saw one. Star Force 4, duo comes back. Everyone's screwed because, you know, uh, navvies aren't a thing. <laughs> or barely a thing in Star Force. The asteroid was thus averted. Lan! Lan! Hmm? Lan, are you okay? Uh, huh? What about the asteroid? It's gone. Thanks to you and Mega Man. Oh yeah! Mega Man! Mega Man! Mega Man! No need to yell, I can hear you, Lan. The asteroid's gone, but it's not over. Wait, Regal! Dad! Darn you, darn, you mean I can't get up there? Dad! Lan, grab onto this. Chad! Chad, Chad, I don't know. What are you planning to do, Regal? I'm gonna vanish. I won't let the officials arrest me. Wait! It's not too late to start over. You risked your life to save the planet. Shod's here. He's an official. So if you surrender and pay for your crimes... Lan, I don't think you understand. Paying for my crimes is the furthest thing from my mind. I don't feel an ounce of guilt. You're the ones who should feel guilty. Think if you've done good when you really caused harm. Something that you think is right can actually be evil. Lan, didn't you chase my syndicate's navvy into park area and then destroy a navvy who had no idea what was going on? Chad, you must have deleted countless navvies claiming it was your duty. Some of them were probably innocent. Dr. Hikari, if you hadn't pursued your net navvy project, net crime wouldn't be as bad as it is now. Okay, dude. First of all, if it if it was robotics that was infected, then we get the classic series, and then the Mavericks happened, then the Elf Wars. I mean, evil was going to happen no matter what was created. Come on, dude. And the scientists who uncovered this thrilling, thriving net society exiled a certain robotic scientist and fell into evil what? Ex exiled a certain robotic scientist and fell into evil ways. He was going to be evil no matter what. 
I once knew that ex exiled scientist. He was my father. That means you're... <laughs> Never mind that. Let's stick to the matter at hand. Humans commit crimes without even realizing it. In short, you're all criminals. You and your entire race. Criminals judging criminals? Don't you find it ridiculous? That's why I'm resisting arrest. I won't be judged by anyone. I intend to stick to my beliefs until the bitter end. Even when I'm gone, evil will still remain. Farewell. Wait, wait, Regal! Kinda dark, don't you think? Evil will still remain. I have questions for Battle Network 5, but still. And that was Battle Network 4, except not really. We're nowhere near done. <laughs> well, that's the plot of Battle Network 4. Yeah, we're fine. We finally made it to the credits. It took like five or six attempts of duo, though. I don't know if I should skip this. Nah, we'll let it play. Even if I can't skip it, we'll let it play. Uh, yeah, so... Going through the story... The story again. Yeah, there really isn't anything here. Spent a good few hours yesterday for, looking for the HP memory. Oh, no. Uh, I spent, like, two hours just searching for blue mystery data. Like going through everything. I only missed a couple because I can't I don't have access to it. You missed it in playthrough two. Ooh. Where was it? Do you know? I see. Yeah, so uh speaking uh speaking of multiple playthroughs, Monzai, I was looking into the whole uh free tournament. Oh, it was in Meteor Comp 3. Ooh. Uh I was uh looking into all the 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 Navi transfer thing. And no matter what you do, unless you compare folders, you have to do four playthroughs. That can't be avoided. And if you're only looking for 100% of what the game considers 100%, aka no secret chips, then you only need three playthroughs. But if you want to transfer Navis, it's best to do it at the end of the second playthrough. Because, because those navvies will be considered secret, and you don't need them for 100%, or what what these games consider 100%. But yeah, it's clear that this game was rushed. It barely has a plot. Most of the game is, like, the story is cut off by tournament arcs that actually have no plot relevance whatsoever. I think this game actually did get rushed, though. I'm not sure how the development happened with this, but it needed a little bit more time. It's still, for what it is, as a game, it's still solid enough. Oh, hey, Hideo Kojima. Anyway, uh, still solid enough as a game. It's just like the plot needs more fleshing out. Secret chips count, I think you need... No, you need four. You only need four. Because here's the thing. Each tournament, you fight either, a, like, a basic Navi, whether it's a normal or a heal Navi. You fight a version-exclusive Navi and a non-version-exclusive Navi. That's how the tournaments are set up. And because the other version's Navi are replacing the the uh, the non-version-exclusive Navi, if you fight them all, if you get the other two, the others done by, by playthrough two... Then you can start throwing in the other navvies in playthrough three. You get, you know, you get three of them, and then you need a fourth playthrough to get the other three. Supposedly that should Molly. What you want? You're so needy. I know. Okay, come on, Molly. Come on. Three days after the asteroid incident, Doctor Regal's whereabouts were still unknown, despite a full investigation at the Coliseum in Natopia. A delayed ceremony was held. Oh yeah, we finally get the trophy we uh, earned. Congratulations on another fine win. And thank you for saving the planet. Okay, 
I get the trophy for the Blue Moon Tournament, but Lance should really get, like, some sort of medal for saving the planet. Again. This is the fourth time he's done this. Ladies and gentlemen, Lan has been named World Net Battler Goodwill Ambassador. World Net Battle Goodwill Ambassador. Let's deepen ties between the world's nations through net battles. What's wrong? Why the glum look? That's not like you. Finally got to see. Oh, hey, you got max HP. That's nice. I just can't stop thinking about Reel's last words. I'm not in the mood to celebrate. You mean that thing about evil still remaining? I think he's right. Still, we should all have the power to overcome it. All of us have the power to fight evil. No, uh, we're not going to do that. We're going to save that for the end of playthrough 2 before I transfer. Everyone has a place. In preparation for when Duo once again comes to this planet. Centuries from now. Yeah, you're right. Besides, we're the ones who are going to build a new age. Okay, dude. That Duo setup is perfect for a Star Force game. Duo just comes back. And now, I'd like to ask Lan to show us his technique. Huh? You mean, I, I gotta do something? The crowd wants to see your net battle technique. Please, ready yourself. Uh, net battle technique? Uh, I wonder what I should do. Lan, show us your best move! We came all this way to see you perform. Get it together! Lan, Mega Man, you could do it! Is everyone here? Don't get nervous. You know, it, it probably only works when he's actually fighting something, you know? I mean, there's a theory that Duo does come back in 3, but it got, but got corrupted. Uh... It's been a while since I played 3, or I started like 3 and then stopped halfway through on my replay. Stop stalling, it's gonna get dark soon. And Cha too. Hmm, seems like we got no choice. Ready, Mega Man? Yep, always am. Check in, Mega Man execute. Honestly, he should just be like, Chad, get down here, we'll just have a fight. That's how we'll show my technique. I just click left, left, right, up, down, and A. Yeah, exactly. Maybe occasionally hold B. So. We got the blue moon symbol for being in the game. One. Uh, <coughs> I like how they changed it to these symbols than just the stars from the previous games. I These make it more obvious what you completed. And if you hit continue, you can either continue from your last save or you start the game over on basically round two. And we can. It, it's the same plot. It's the exact same thing. You're, it's new game plus that has to be done. So snap out some battle of three. Plant Man and Flash Man are broken. Yeah, they are. Molly, stop. Come on. Molly, come on. You're fine. It is... It, we have to do New Game Plus. We do get to keep everything. Virus scan, Navi Custom. So, I guess we somehow keep these emails. And... Yeah. To 100% this, we have to play this multiple times. Let's try to... Try to leave without uh, receiving money from Dad? Okay, we could try that. I'm pretty sure Lan will stop you. And now that we're on round two, we're fighting higher level enemies. Molly, come on. That's enough. That's enough. Come on. I know what she wants. Uh, I'll probably rearrange my folder back to what it was before. So this is how we're supposed to get start getting level 2 chips. Uh, that battery icon was the blue moon symbol. Uh, Popcorn Dog. If you're playing... If you're playing Red Sun, you would get a Red Sun symbol. Oh, that doesn't work. Reflect for the win. At least they don't make us do the tutorial. Oh, the battery next to your name. Oh, okay. Either way. 
Okay. And Guardian. Okay, that's all done. I'm going back in because I missed the blue mystery data. Man, it would be very nice to have some sort of checklist for blue mystery data to just mark off. So I wouldn't have to do like a complete search of everything. Thousand Zenny. So try to leave without talking to dad. I gotta get some money from daddy. Wow, I have never heard Mega Man say daddy. He they would usually just say dad. Okay. So there there's your answer, Monzai Man. You can't leave. Even though I have plenty of money. Hell! Like, the the part to repair the microwave was 500 zenny. The blue mystery data was 500 zenny, so you don't even need that. Yeah, I have plenty of money. Let's at least get the recover part. You just wanted to see the line. <laughs> it's like, you never hear him say daddy. It's just dad. And we lost all of our shortcuts because, you know, we started over. We haven't done those yet. We haven't done a tournament. What tournament? Those don't exist. We basically lost everything. Although we still keep some of our stuff. It's so uncomfortable. <laughs> it, it really is. Skull doors are back. Blue mystery data. Triple crack. So if we didn't... In, in playthrough one, that was the, I think, like, the s half energy, right? And now it's triple crack. If you didn't pick that up, and then you go into playthrough two, it would be the half energy. So that's the entire point of why we did all that searching around. So you don't lose out on it, but it means you could do one less playthrough. <laughs> 500 zenny is expensive, I know, right? Yeah, I need to rearrange my fault. <laughs> but now we're gonna get stronger stuff. What am I doing? I have Reflect! It's so much better than Mega Buster. I keep forgetting. Can't really go... Oh, do I keep my sub chips? I do keep my sub chips, okay. I have one unlocker on me. I could have bought more, but I spent most of my the majority of my money on uh the reflect. <laughs> and it was worth it, I think. Emphasis on I think. Actually, let's just heal. Uh, wait, I'm at full health anyway. That lead missile? What is that gonna do, Hawkhorn Dog? How's that gonna? What's that gonna do? Is that gonna mess with me, or is it gonna mess with the internet? I don't know. I don't like the sound of that. I think the shops are the same. Oh yeah, you're not open yet anyway. Three hundred zenny. There's no blue mystery data in area two. Basically gun. Oh well, yeah, I guess that would. Yep. Oh no, I can't hit you. You're invisible to me. I get down here. The power of Reflect. It's kind of weird how we don't have Shockwave anymore. We just have the Guard. Shockwave feels like a staple of Battle Chips. And our first purple? Anti-Electric. Pretty good. 200 damage, right? Yep. Too bad I don't have... I'm not up against a Navi. I can really utilize that. Uh, let's get rid of some of my stuff. Uh, let's see. We're, I need air hockey back.
Then I need to do other program advances, so we'll go with this. Uh, get rid of my swords. Need to at least try that once. I might, I might still keep that. Magnum. Uh, I might get rid of that. It's strong, but kind of hard to hit things with. Okay, I guess we'll keep it then. I guess we'll keep it for now. Blue mystery data is right there. And now we get a bug frag. Repair a small parts to repair Mr. Progs. What do you say? Want to buy something? Hopper is really sick right now. The only way I can help, the only way I can help is to make money for medicine. You want the recover patch? It's very expensive. Five hundred zenny. It's very expensive, my dude. See, like, I lost five hundred zenny. That's that's so bad. Cost. I know, right? <laughs> Uh... No luck. Is there a way to power up, like, the soul's charge shot, like, for Aquaman? Because 20 damage is still not that much. At least we don't have to hear the danger music. And since the story doesn't change, we can just kind of speed through the plot. You know, that's nice. I'm just speeding through text. I can't go into Dex's house yet because he's right in front, so I can't check his GameCube. <laughs> can't go into Yai's house yet. Not that she has, like, any sort of, like, jack-in spot other than her computer. Oh, I can check the dock house. Yeah, I got full cuss from Lauder God. Again, I just pulled up a list and just double-checked everything. I went everywhere. And there were a couple spots that I completely missed. And look, you're not locked out at level 1 stuff. Weaker enemies tend to pop up in like these, uh, just side, I don't know what you call these, these side jacking spots. So you're not locked out of earlier chips. But usually, if you really want to get the earlier chips, you're better off on your, fir on your first run through. Uh, okay, yeah, we just need to talk to Mail and Yai. Oh, there's a 10 chip trader now. Okay, and that's there. I still prefer to get them all before moving on. It's just easier to figure out where they are. Exactly. And we get a bug frag. We also get a full energy, because why not? I'm not worried about level 1 chips and stuff like that. That's not what I'm wor worried about. I mean, it's probably a decent idea to get it done when you when you can. And of course, because of the power of time travel, Shade Man's still alive.
Oh yeah, go over to the square. We get to hear it talks about a tournament. And then you head home. There we go. See how fast this is going when I just skip every cutscene? <laughs> <coughs> the only cutscenes I don't need to skip are, like, the tournament ones. So a lot of this goes a lot faster. E EX codes for level 1 viruses. Yeah, I... I think those can actually be missable, or at least some of them do. Okay. And wait, can I go into Dex's house? Yes, I can. We could go into his GameCube. Yeah, it really is a wacky experience, isn't it? And this is the main reason why people don't like 4, by the way. I mean, it's one thing to say it has probably the weakest plot. We can maybe say it has the weakest plot. Uh, but this is the main reason people don't like this one. It's because you have to play this game three times. Both versions? No, just the one, Monzai. Uh, the other version is just something I'm going to play on my own time when I'm bored. We're just doing the one game. Because there, there really isn't anything different. Hey, Lan, how's it going? Move it, Dex! I need to access your GameCube. There's money in there that you hid or you didn't know what was there. Either way, Dex, you really should check your GameCubes. I still have my GameCube, and we're kind of at the point where we're almost at net navvies. I should get a net navvy and have it enter my GameCube and see if there's money in there. That would be nice, right? Oh, dang it. You're gonna do both. Oh, okay. Probably only gonna go for the secret chips near the end of the third player. You don't have the navy chips in the other versions. So, that's the thing. To technically get 100%, you, uh, you don't need the other version's navvies. Or, if not that, then, uh, uh, then you just folder compare. So it's really important to get, say, Top Man and, S and Spark Man, you know, from the first tournament. It's more important to get that than to get Fire Man and Guts Man from the first tournament, if that makes sense. How much money do it got? What, the GameCube? I don't know. I don't have a Navi. I can't go in my game. We have a lot of money, though. But we need to save all that money for unlockers. I want to be able to demo the souls and giga chips. Right. Alright, roll is kidnapped. Why do I have an email? Oh, right, the Yai code thing. Might as well get that opened. Can I make the shortcut? Yeah, we can. It's nice to get done right now. And you know what sucks is, like, that side quest that we have to do to get the Nebula Code, like the Django side quest, we have to do it again. Gonna do any interactive between the two until the end of the playthroughs. So I can show off use. Use the secret chips. I never have the chips to get you anyway. These exclusive ones. Hmm. I can't get the. I don't. I used up my unlocker, so I can't open that. Is there another green? Nope. Yeah, the secret chips, from what I understand, is. Whichever one you get is based on the HP of the opponent you're fighting against. 
But if you are fighting against an opponent with a thousand HP, it'll first give you chips that you don't have. So that's a way to get the level ones. Video man and Spark Manor to go to? Hmm. Yeah, it's gonna be a while before we buy unlockers again. So I wanna save my money for those and the board parts. Let's go get the blue mystery data. I was kind of hoping he would go in the middle. Mm. Yeah, we'll go with this. Perfect. Could be more useful to others rather than get all secret chips. Yeah, exactly. And that's the goal, too. And that's another reason why you don't necessarily want to use a dark chip. Because you permanently go down to 9999. Yeah, I know. Like, if, if there was only a way to get the get the HP back, that would be nice. What if there was like a Navi customizer program that takes up maybe the whole grid. Like, have it be ridiculously, like, costly to use it. But what, uh, what it does is it gets any HP loss that you got back. And it's really just useful for <coughs> multiplayer in cases like that. If I could get more flame lane twos, I might throw those in. So I use them. Did I get the blue mystery data here? No, it's right there, okay. A lot of money. Idea is you can never truly undo the evil of it. As many shows you can. Oh, really? The anime did that? Just undo all the damage? Alright. We'll do this. We'll finish up this Shade Man scenario. At least this is speeding up now that I'm not reading all the text. Here? Nope. We have to go this way. Don't. Too dangerous! I can't go in! Yeah, it, it felt, maybe if multiplayer had a different way of handling, handling it than just HP. Shade Man is actually threatening Fanful. I mean, Shade Man was always a cool robot master, or just enemy. Uh, I did kind of watch the anime. Oh, we need to go in here. And for one, I was watching the English dub, and that's the first mistake, because it's the four kids version. But, you know, I'm typically a dub over sub, but that was one I should have just gone with this sub. But, um, I got to somewhere around Battle Network 3. I remember seeing Beast Man, and that's about it. But I do think I might need to give that show another try, but obviously Japanese subs for that one. Yeah, uh, while I didn't really get to watch the anime, I did collect the manga for Battle Network. And that was my more experience with Battle Network outside of the games. Yeah, I, I also didn't... I don't think I realized that either, that four kids just skipped episodes. Not, like, I knew about the... The... 
uh, seasons that didn't make it over. I figured, eh, I'll just watch dub until, you know, uh, they get to the the stuff that didn't make it. Then I swatch, switch to shit. I can't speak today. <laughs> then I swap over. But no, I just stopped at some point. I think the four kids, like, dialogue was just really getting to me. Oh, it was Viz Media? Well, it still feels like a four kids dub. It still feels like one. That's how I got... That's how you know I get it confused. Hey, when they swapped the names of, like, rice balls to cupcakes, it still feels like a four kids dub. Because I know that. They changed rice balls to cupcakes. So, forgive me for confusing with four kids. It just sounds like they did the same thing. I don't have much experience with Viz dubs. Like, I can't think of other anime that they did. I'm more used to four kids, and even then I didn't get to watch four kids that often. If it was four kids, Mega Man would have sounded like Yami Yui, and Lan would have sounded like Brock. Yeah, I mean, yeah, four kids had, like, a small pool of actors that they just reused. Actually, no, uh, I don't think Mega Man would have sounded like Yami Yugi. He would have just sounded like Sonic. You know they would have given him, uh, Sonic's voice actor. Lan, I don't think they would have given Brock's voice actor, but, uh, actually they probably used the same actor for not Yami Yugi, but, uh, normal Yugi. I could see that. I remember, like, it, to me, it sounded like Mega Man almost sounded like a surfer, like a surfer bro. I mean, the, the Mega Man on the title screen is the same English voice actor. They brought him back. I remember in the when I watched the dub, he sounded a little bit like a surfer bro. You know what? I'm close to a program advance. Let's just get that done. No, what would be funny if Lan was voiced by Mike Pollock, the voice of Eggman? <laughs> that would be funny. I can't reflect this guy. Break through my shield. And you know what? Just for fun. We haven't gone to Junk Soul yet. Oh no, he's confused. And my charge shot does... My charge shot does nothing. Because there's nothing around. And uh, you get your Navi Recycle. Or your Chip Recycle. Magnet Shock 1. 200 damage. It's just a stronger variant. I think I'll, you know, keep the magnets, but I'll probably make them the same code. I don't need the program advance. Uh, I think C is better for my folder. I can't wait to get more uh, air hockey's level two. It would be amazing if Lane was voiced by Long John Baldry, the voice of Robotnik from the original cartoon. Oh no, Doctor Ivo Robotnik. Suping as usual, I see. No, you know what would work better? Uh, Lan is voiced by the original Robotnik, and Mega Man's voiced by Mike Pollock. There you go. We'll use this.
Would they just make Mike Pollock Dr. Wily if four kids had it? You know, just not even be subtle about it. Just make your evil doctor voiced by this, uh, the guy that voices another evil doctor. I am Lan. I am here to save the world. And I, I'm gonna create great health care by saving the planet. Clearly, uh, that 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 would be the plan. I don't think that would work. Where is the other cyber bat? Where is it? Uh, this. Get back! Oh. Let me be quick. Let me be clear, uh, world. I will stop the asteroid. Yeah, uh, there you go. That's more like it, I guess. Actually, we'll go to Aqua Soul. I know, like, very controversial. There we go. Get it out of here. No, you know what? It it's for kids, you know. They wouldn't make Obama land. They totally make him Raul, though. Right? You know, Thunderman's operator. <laughs> or is that too on the nose? Let's see if I can hit that guy in the back. There you go. Perfect timing. The U.S. is going to send you a sword ship, then a white sword, followed by a long sword. Uh, program events. Yeah, well, I don't know the Obama voice, right? I, I don't think I do a good Obama impression, so, like, my attempts are very... not that great. Get rid of all the cyber bats. Yeah, male. Who... You know they would just make her, uh, oh, what was, what was the voice actress's name? It's, it's Amy Rose's voice actress. They would totally just do that. You know, it's either that or roll. Male voice by Chris Pratt. Oh, no. Just when I think they couldn't get any worse with Chris Pratt's, uh, voice choices. Maybe I need to give the Japanese anime a watch. Just watch all the way through. As a Battle Network fan, I'm a fake fan by not watching all of the anime. I need the sonar. I've read the manga, but, you know, you're a fake fan if you haven't played all the games, every, si every spin-off game. Uh, you haven't read all the manga, you haven't read, uh, you haven't watched all the anime, you know. If you haven't done all that, you're a fake fan, clearly. Chris Pratt's Mega Man. Oh, you know if there's a live action or... You know for a fact if there's going to be some sort of Mega Man movie... That they're going to make Chris Pratt Mega Man. Unless it's a live action variant, you know. If it's a live action variant... No, you know what? If we get some sort of something Mega Man related as a Hollywood movie... You know they're using Tom Holland. You know that you know they're gonna do that.
Yeah, he's even. Unlike in the games where for some reason she's like, nah, let's make her look like an angry goblin child. <laughs> I love that description of Yai. Angry goblin child. Granted, it, she is like, what, three years younger than everyone else? She's just like supposed to be very smart, so she jumped a few grades. I think that's the explanation, unless their parents just paid a lot of money to jump her up a few grades, I don't know. She does have a big forehead, though. Vin Diesel as Guts. Or, uh, Dex. Not Guts. Actually, Vin Diesel as Guts, as Guts man. I can kind of see that. And Glide just exists. Seriously, what game has Glide ever done anything? Glide is such an underutilized character. Like, what's the point of him? She's brought here. They bring it up once uh, the episode guy is introduced and they bring her up her intelligence ever again. I know, right? And then Yai is voiced by Aquafina, because, you know, that makes perfect sense, right? Angry Goblin Child, that's how I view Aquafina. I mean, that's how she's typecast. Ran used his brain damage powers to make her the next project. Oh, you're going to be in Japan in two weeks. That's very cool. I, I need to go to Japan someday. Like, that's something I need to do. I, damn be three months uh just for vacation or is there something like uh job related that you're doing oh i saw it is that the last one or is there another one yeah we got them all program in depth ah okay oh no it's shade man and then we gotta turn down the volume yeah, I hope you have a, uh, where are you going to Japan? Like, are you going to, uh, Tokyo? Or, what area? Are you gonna go there and then start trying to find some, like, Japanese-only video game cartridges? Tokyo. Oh, okay. Now it's the fight with Shade Man! This is the hardest fight in the game! See? Totally hard. Can't- I- I- I can't hit him! See? Like, this is the hardest fight. See? I hate forced to lose fights. Yeah, I do too, because you know if you lost all your HP, that's a game over. You already know that would happen. I gotta take the chip to Higsby. And what do we got? We got rollback. He gave us his dex code. Sweet. At, if there's going to be... Here's the thing about forced loss fights. I hate when you still have to win the fight. You know? If I lose all my HP, that should still count. Okay, Electman and Battle Network 1 at least I think makes sense. I think he heals himself too fast for you to be able to do anything. You would need, like, a super strong program advance to hit him. You know, before you hit him with the... Before you turn off the generator. Elden Ring does it well? Okay. 
Oh no, an asteroid's coming. We'll, we'll skip that. Is there a game that's done the Force loss right? You know, that's done it in a, in a way that makes sense. Gut shoot, gut spin three is possible. Oh. 600 damage? Oh, Electman has only 600. Okay, yeah, I guess that works. Gutsman 3. Hmm. Can you, wait, can you get Gutsman 3 by the time you fight a Luckman? I'm assuming we're talking Battle Network 1, right? Are, wait, does it do 600? I thought it didn't get that big of a boost to help Battle Network 3. Hold on, I'm, I'm curious. Uh... Oh, I'm just taking a quick look. Advance. Uh, you could get Gutsman 3 before Iceman. Oh, okay. The first fight in the game you're meant to lose and cutscene happens. People have beaten the enemy before because for employers I've got no life is supposed to lose. Oh, okay. Thanks, Elden Ring. <laughs> okay, uh, let me find Gut Shoot. Special series. Gut Shoot. No, Gut Shoot is 500 damage. Uh, so, if Gut Shoot is 500 damage, let me look at Elect Man. Electman is still one of my favorite designs of Battle Network anyway. Such a cool design. Okay, let's see. Stop trying to load things. Making the thing move down. Uh, Operation shooting stuff. Uh, no, 600 gut shoot won't do it. Guts man is... Three is a hundred. Oh, okay. So you have to use gut shoot and then immediately throw in a guts man three. Okay, I, I see. I see what you're going with. I guess that works. You can definitely hit him before he heals. Has someone ever actually beat a luck man that way before you're supposed to turn off the generator? And then it's just like, no, I I lost. No, we need to stop his electricity. But after 500, they make him invincible. Oh, they just straight up cheat then. So you need to use Gutsman 3 and then use Guts Shoot to drop him down to zero. That'd be funny to mess around with. Uh, bar is gone, but it, hap it happened in... Oh, okay. So it goes to zero, but then Lan's like, oh, we can't. Lan and Mega Man are like, we can't do anything to this guy. And you can take over the world, and no one can stop him. They are far away. They are stuck in time, and they are close to Lan to lose all their brain cells. Oh, man. Lan has that weird superpower. He has the power of Zorarudo. And then, you know, when they're close by, they ha he has the power to make people dumber. That That is. That's a, that's a weird power, you know. I, I, that might be too broken. But anyway. Uh, we just finished the Shade Man scenario. We're going to do the... We're going to start the tournament, and we're going to do that next time. Molly is definitely needy and wants a walk. I can tell that's what she wants. Anyway, thanks for everyone who showed up. We're doing these streams Monday through Friday at noon Pacific time. If you want to see the old streams that are not on Twitch anymore, they're on YouTube six, uh, YouTube at scottbot 64 Stream Archives. There's a link in the about page. Any damage done to Luckman happens, and then he becomes invincible and heals. And she Electman does cheat in that first fight. Child needs a redemption scene because he's kind of a loser. Um, I don't think Battle Network 4 gives it because, you know, side plot because of the whole tournament thing. I think he gets that in 5 if you play Team Proto Man. I won't be playing Team Proto Man, but uh, I, I'm trying to remember how that works. But I know there's a little bit more character development for Chad in that particular game. If you play Team Pro Man instead of Team Colonel, four kind of does. 
Okay, we'll be getting there. But I think I, I think you get more redemption for Chad in five Team Proto Man. I think. I'll be playing Team Colonel when I get there. Anyway, uh, yeah, I'm gonna wrap it up. Have a good day. Later. Finally on round two.